let's get it, let's get it. Hey, hey. I look a train wreck. Oh, I do too. That's what I'm showing you guys and not myself. <laughs> Check out my Snapchat and I will take those pictures of her. <laughs> We're eating at City Kitchen. <laughs> it was a long flight. Look, I look like the Bride of Frankenstein. <laughs> Wait, I've been here for two days and still looking bad. So. <laughs> We're eating at City Kitchen and we got donuts and stuff for breakfast. And we almost lost our lives on the plane right here. That's gonna have to be in between the time when we like sit down and are getting ready. I'm just gonna have to sit down and tell that story in whole. Because not even just the plane. It was just everything. And she almost wasn't gonna make this video because she left this camera on the plane. It's a whole story time, <laughs> so we'll get into it, but it was good stuff. That's it right now. I'm gonna do Anastasia the reason for the whole trip. It's, Mom's skipping ahead four hours. I'm just saying. We're going to Anastasia. Um, no, but I haven't literally filmed nothing yet, so I'm gonna have to film an intro and then probably put this clip in. So it's a rainy, nasty day here in New York City, but the rain's supposed to stop soon. And it, yeah. And it's worth it. And we will tell you how intimately involved we were with this nasty, cloudy sky <laughs> in my almost death story. So, you ain't mine. Oh no, I cried for 10 minutes straight on the airplane. So. She clung to my arm, and I was like, like a, it's okay. Like I was three years old. And in my head, planning how Maggie and Brian would survive. <laughs> well, not to mention Jack and I'm Matt. just gonna let you all know if that would have happened, I just would have stayed here. I would be so traumatized, I would never go back home. Not even like I can't get on a plane. I'd be like, all right, guys, well, I live in New York City now. So yeah, it was awful. Like, I was literally planning the schedule of who to call, like, if the plane went down. That's how bad it was. And you it didn't was, even have me in the exit row to help. I know, like, what so It was a terrible situation. Oh my gosh, it was a lot, but we're here now. We're eating donuts. I have hot chocolate. Uh, but I will say for the record, we have a huge room. Yeah, huge. Never happens. I want to say in New York. But I will say for the record, nobody else on the plane was freaked out. True. It was only me. <laughs> and me. But it's it not because bad. it wasn't bad. It was bad. Everyone else, I guess, was just used to it. Well, we're playing it cool, which I would have done if I was by myself, but I had my mom there, so I was acting like a four year old. And I was playing it cool. Well, yeah, exactly. mom was playing it cool. With knowing the weather, we're very much expecting it to be. Well, he did come on. He, he the pilot was on very good. Said, it's going to be. We're going to have moderate turbulence. And I've never heard him say moderate. I've heard light or, or like or beware. We're going to have a little bit of turbulence. turbulence. He was he like, it's going to be moderate. Like, Buckle in. That's not a good sit thing. tight. Friend. And here's the thing: when the turbulence, it was the fact that you could see nothing. I took a video that doesn't like, even do it justice. I know what it looked like at the plane, but <laughs> literally, <laughs> that was it. But at 700 miles per hour. Like, and, and like this, just in the like couple minutes since you started this, that sky has gotten yeah, yeah. significantly more. You could pray for more. Yeah. And I was like, this is it. This is literally it. Or I'm about to meet you. At least you had your mom there. You're like, I got this oh, great wedding and dress, I and I'm never gonna be able to use it. Gripping. She was literally holding on to me. I was, and I was laying like, on her. I was sobbing. Like, <laughs> That's so cute. <sighs> Uh, and then it was just like drama from that point on. It made my on. heart very happy, you'll have to say. <laughs> Mom was like, I bet. That happened since she was like three. <laughs> <laughs> it was just all the drama from that point on, but we'll, we'll give you a recap of everything Ooh. in the hotel room. But Maggie came early, so she's been here just chilling by herself. Because we were supposed to be here last night. Yeah, because I didn't even tell you guys that our plane got canceled. That'll be in the intro Ooh. too. I'm just going to have to cover a whole bunch of stuff. But. Yeah, that's us. We're just kind of so exploring I've been for a little bit. City by myself, all alone. Oh, poor Maggie, getting yeah. to see Broadway shows oh, and hang out. That's terrible. Fun. Okay, that's it. We are gonna walk around, and it's rainy, so I can't really have my camera out too much. But I'll try to get some fun little clips of us doing stuff. So excited! I'm New York City. Here's the Phantom of the Opera Theater. Here is Frozen. which we will be at in just a few moments. Not moments, hours. I set my camera up now because it's raining. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at this shirt. Look at little Cricky in there. Oh, I love little Cricky. That is the best. They contain Lucky Bugs. <laughs> Catch it down in New Orleans. 
That's cute. Super cute. And Maggie for your favorite princess. Oh. <laughs> Maggie loves Merida and the movie Brave. <laughs> I'm only smiling because I'm in New York City. <laughs> I think she maybe feels about brave the way I feel about... <laughs> just kidding. Are you, are you vlogging? Yes. Or are, is it a Disney vlog or just your adventures? It, it started that. Oh, I did the Disney College program. <laughs> I love when I meet DCP. <laughs> we just met the nicest cast, cast member. We did. She was so sweet. She just talked to us for a long time. She watches Disney videos and not mine, but she was but just very soon. nice. Maybe soon. Who's in that one? I don't know. Oh, there's Mickey. There's Peter. Peter Donald. Donald, my man. This is just so magical and lovely. And then, boom, Times Square. Woo! Pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm getting scanned for my mood. Are you ready? Yeah. They're reading your aura. They're getting a sick of smoke. What color am I gonna be? No doubt about it, you got plenty of style. Don't we know it, but have you got enough chocolate? Never enough chocolate. Am I right, I mean, ladies? That's true. Dum, dum, dum. Oh, purple. Aww. Hey, that's the truth. Why was mom the only thing about chocolate? The nervous one was too. You're oh, nervous okay. and everyone's gonna steal your chocolate. Well, that was a fun little thing. I love this gap. Come on. Heck of a view from the M&M store. Holy cow. So cool. So, we are right now heading to the Dear Evan Hansen Theater, where we are not watching Dear Evan Hansen, but I had someone reach out to me who's brother is Dear Evan Hansen on Broadway for like Saturday matinees and Wednesday night performances or something and her like she watches my videos and all this stuff and literally offered for us to come backstage and see everything backstage which is like so crazy we weren't able to see a performance that he was in so we're gonna do that um I Loki kind of nervous that this is a catfish and we're gonna show up and it's not gonna be her. Okay, Abby, I know. Like, Hello, catfish. Abby, if you are who you say you are, I'm so sorry, but you've gotta understand it's kind of nerve wracking. It seems too good to be true. It seems too good to be true, but we're walking up on the theater in just a second. So it's either gonna be Abby or it's gonna be a creepy old man who's trying to kidnap us. We don't know. But I can take them, I'm not worried. I'm open for both. I'm excited. <laughs> So no, no, we are a new friend. ready and so excited and just can't believe that this is happening if it's actually happening. We're about to get there, so let's see who is meeting us on the other end. Okay, so we are here backstage at the Dear Evan Hansen where it's the theater. This is Michael. He plays Dear Evan Hansen and other various yes, things sure. yep. on Broadway here. And yep. then this is Abby, his sister, who literally made all of this happen, which is so cool. And to my great enjoyment, she is not a catfish, so, all right. Um, but this is so cool, and we just wanted to say thanks to them because oh, they showed us around this whole thing. Yeah, thanks so much yeah. for coming. Thanks for the show. Oh, yeah, yeah literally, this is the whole, the whole deal. Everything is blue here. Yeah. Oh, here's my um, name up here I signed. Yeah, <laughs> um, so, yeah so it's just so cool. This is kind of their green room, but yeah, blue. But blue. Yeah. And just a fun little... Area where they hang yeah, out yeah. and Does it come from bring across people. Across yeah, come from way across the street. Oh yeah. Hey, awesome. like yeah, there's all the other stuff out hey, there. Did you see this is so like cool. From fans and things. Oh yes, those are some fans. Oh fun, fun. but yeah, yeah Abby Thanks like back. literally yeah. reached out to me so and is I was so nervous, <laughs> <laughs> but she's so real and so nice and so wonderful yeah. and. 
She looks like Mackenzie, does she not? <laughs> hey Mackenzie, <laughs> shout out. <laughs> um, this is seriously movie. the coolest thing it ever. So We're oh, yeah. so, yeah. this is just you the think coolest. Was most oh! Yeah. So, yeah. thank you, Abby. You're so welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Say bye to everyone. Bye. Yeah, this is the best. <laughs> Okay, that was genuinely the coolest thing. Coolest the thing. absolute <laughs> coolest thing. We literally walked all backstage. We walked we, on the stage. We walked on, on the stage. stage. We have pictures. Well, I'll put in any pictures that we and... have. Oh my gosh, it was just like genuinely the coolest. The coolest. Whoop. And they were so nice. Oh my gosh. Be nice. Like, so seriously, cool. so Even sweet. Even after you accused them of a fake I know. But like, they got it, you know? <laughs> Abby is the sweetest person. Well, they Abby, both were. I mean, they were both incredible. All right, we gotta get on this side. We gotta cut through. Oh, oh, I love that. I to be best friends with her now because I just love her. I know. I love her. I mean, we were Abby, there for like, Abby, what time is Sarah Best gonna be your best friend now? <laughs> we literally oh are. Like, I feel so connected to her. We'll make I holiday her. plans. <laughs> I know. I'm gonna text her and be like, okay, we gotta keep in touch now. No, but that was genuinely just the most cool thing, like an honest dream. Like, we were literally on a Broadway stage and got to see all the tech things happening. Oh my gosh. That was amazing. Abby, thank you so much. Michael, thank you, thank you, thank you so you. much. That was the best. So now we are um, rushing to Anastasia. We were there, we were there for like over an hour. Um, yeah, over an hour. So we're rushing to Anastasia. No, we're just so excited. Okay, best day already. It's like it's 3 p.m. and it's already been a full, perfect, wonderful day. <laughs> we're going, fam. We're going. So the other thing finally doing it. I know. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, so we just got into Anastasia, and I don't really want to like film up and big because I don't want them to think that I'm gonna be like bootlegging this during the show. But we are in the mezzanine and we're front row in the mezzanine. We have incredible seats. Hold on. We'll speed down. Yes. Seriously, so crazy cool. We're at these seats. I just can't believe we're finally here and we actually made it. I can't eat it. Oh, you showed me with my glasses on. That's embarrassing. Hey. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna put this up there, sis. I'm gonna put this up so they don't think that I'm gonna bootleg this whole thing. Okay, bye. Getting a hot dog in here. Just casually sitting in the middle of Times Square eating a hot dog with all the giant screens around us and fake Mickeys and Minis. Who will have their head off all the time? <laughs> they just walk around with their heads off. It's kind of scary. Um, Anastasia was amazing. So good. Incredible. So good. Anastasia. I know, we just so did glad. it. Like, we made this trip happen because of that. So It's very, very, very good. We are eating hot dogs on the go because we don't have time for dinner. Because waitress starts in like 45 minutes. So, <laughs> we're going to so eat real quick and then we were almost late. the theater. We were almost late for Anastasia because we were backstage at Dear Van Hansen. Yep. Almost late for the waitress. I oh, know. Because oh Anastasia. Yeah. So, uh, a lot. Bad so day. many Broadway shows we're visiting today. <laughs> it's just too good. It's too good. <laughs> Life's so, you know, <laughs> so stressful. Um, yeah, going back to the real world on Tuesday is gonna be very sad. Oh, oh. Not even on Tuesday, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Getting back on a plane is gonna be awesome. I know. <laughs> um, and I feel like these vlogs are just like super random, so I don't know how I'm gonna split them up, whether it be two days or just throw it all into one day. Because I didn't get a whole lot from today because it was raining I hope all day. That you do it all in one day, and then I think you should do musical numbers in between each little video to <laughs> represent the musical. Okay. Okay, okay, yeah, gotcha. I just wanted to burst into song standing on the stage. It was so incredible. Um, but yeah, we're just well, they're done eating. I'm just gonna finish this and then we're gonna head that way. Woo this is literally just the craziest thing. The hotel we're staying at is literally directly across from the Barrymore Theater, which is amazing. I can't wait. They make pies. Mom and Maggie said they have good drinks. We're seeing Joey McIntyre from New Kids on the Block. It's gonna be a good time. Okay, so we're in the Waitress Theater and they give you these cute little pies. Well, they have you pay all for the them. different. Well, yeah, you pay for them, <laughs> but you get pie, which is fun. 
and then this is the stage down here and it looks obviously like a pie which is fun and we're so, we're so excited so excited so excited we can't wait this is the best day ever honestly um but yeah we have our pies we have our drinks we are ready to go to Ain't watch much more to, go. to watch i know so here we are, our last show of this trip. Only the second, but. <laughs> yeah, the only day of our trip. But <laughs> the yeah. only day of our trip. But yeah, it's been incredible. So I'm gonna put this up so we can enjoy pie and hang out and so that people don't think I'm bootlegging again. <laughs> okay, we just got done with Waitress. Oh my gosh, literally I'm sobbing. How do you feel? I love it so much. Beef. That show is, that wrecks me. It I does. I cried like four times. It wrecks me emotionally every single freaking time I see it. And I'm so so daggum good. So good. And I'm Man. not emotional. Like that gets me yeah. every time. It's impossible not to be got by it, honestly. God. Oh, it's right. just the best. That's why it's my favorite. It's so good. It's so good. And they all just like kicked it into overdrive in the second so act. Yeah, yeah second it was act just was like, incredible. shoot, it was good. Yeah. Um, but we came back to our hotel room for a little second, but we're leaving now to go get dinner for the first meal that we've eaten today. First meal today. Guys, we had donuts. We had donuts. We had donuts, <laughs> we had donuts and then we had a hot dog yeah. on the go. Okay, we've had two meals. But two not full, healthy, well-rounded yeah. meal. <laughs> we're gonna go to Junior's. Yes. Yeah. I'm tired. But I don't think I can eat their cheesecake. We started this day at 2.30. Yeah, 2.30 a.m. And I'm sleepy. I'm feeling good. <laughs> Are we gonna reinvent our Disneyland, Disneyland yeah. dancing? <laughs> this is the most magical day. We're so magical. We're in the hallway. We're not in the Magic Kingdom, but we're in New York City, so it's oh, almost kind of better. <laughs> Sorry. Right. Okay, night time in Times Square, which we haven't been here at night yet. I haven't. Anyway. Wow. So see there's the creepy Mickey Minis and all them. Ooh. You know wow. you're not a Disney win. Dear Evan Hansen, rip, but we saw your whole backstage. Okay, I'll update you guys when we get to dinner because it's crazy out here and having my arm extended is a little in the way. Okay, we made it to Junior's. We're sitting down. We're so starved and hungry. We're getting burgers and roast beef sandwiches. Alright, it's gonna be good. First meal all day. Um, but yeah, way too loud I'm here to film anything. So that's it. We'll see you after dinner. Okay, <laughs> it's getting cold and we're about to head back to our room. But we're enjoying our last little minutes here at nighttime. It's so different at nighttime. I know. There's the aquarium up there, how clear that was. That's oh, yeah, so cool. way up there. Oh, it's not the aquarium oh, anymore. It's so fun. And Jack Graham, I saw a little advertisement for The Bachelorette here a little while ago. Just We'll watch it tomorrow. But we're just enjoying our last little bit. Everyone's squishing here. So fun. I love you, bud. It's been fun. I know. It's such a good trip. And we saw a part of a day, day tomorrow. Time. I know. It just won't be Times Square at night. Yeah, no Times Square at night. But I'm getting cold. And we've had about mm, three hours of sleep, maybe four, cumulative. You had a 15 minute nap, too. <laughs> oh. And it's starting to smell weird out here. But a lot of weed in New York goodbye City. Goodbye, Times Square at nighttime. We'll see you in the morning at noon. Not noon, at normal time. Yes. Oh, heck <laughs> yeah. Like so. We're going to sleep in all noon in New York City. <laughs> That's it. I love it. Alrighty. Bye. Bye. Oh, it's cold. Bye. Good morning. We are on our way. Ooh, it is windy. Look, there's Hamilton. It is a warm 45 degrees this morning. Sunny. Hooray. <laughs> we don't have to fly out of clouds again today. We are. Gosh, that bus is loud. We're on our way to find a brunch spot. I know, it's so much better when it's not raining. We're on our way to find something for brunch, and then we're gonna go to Central Park and 
look around some places like that. So it's gonna be a fun little morning. I can't wait. <laughs> Lies and deceit. We did not go where we thought we were gonna go. Um, I am so depressed. <laughs> Maggie's very sad she can't see this show, burn this, because Adam dropped her. It opens in, in it. four days. Previews are four <laughs> days. And she's very upset. Can I just stay here? Have fun. I'm just gonna live on the streets for a couple days. Live on the streets. Um, and Brian Cranston's in something right now. New York Network. The Belasco. In New York. Is he, this, he's in New York. Is this where Dear Evan Hansen was supposed to be? Yes. That's what they were talking yeah. about last oh, time. Right. Pretty cool. So I'll update everyone when we figure out where we're going. Here's our hotel from last time. But we don't know. We finally found some place to eat brunch. We went to a million different places and couldn't find Close anything. the kitchen somewhere. We couldn't find anything anywhere. And then we were like, oh, there's one that had like brunch and all kinds of other foods too. So we're like, let's stop in here. It was super cute. Everything was wooden and it was just really cute. No one, yeah, Lily's, don't go there. No one was there to like tell us if we sat down or just like waited to be seated or what. Like no one was even paying attention to us. So we were like, okay, I guess we'll just sit down. And then the woman who did work there walked over to us, not even walked over to us, screamed at us from across the bar and was like, oh, we actually don't have the kitchen available right now, so you can't be here. She didn't say it like that. She was like, we don't have the kitchen available. That's true. Like that was fault. very mad. Yeah, it's like we did something wrong. We were like, okay, we're gonna go then. Um, but we walked down the block a little bit more and came to mom and we're so glad we did. It's the cutest thing. Everything's like very kind of old school. I mean, it's called mom's, so I feel like you're supposed to kind of feel like a little kid, I guess. Not to feel like a little kid. I think it's a chain. I think there's one thing. Yeah, it might be a chain. I don't know. Sorry, all this music is playing and I'm going to have to take the video down because of copyright laws. It's fine. Okay, so we made it to the Central Park area and we came to the Central Park Zoo. We're not like in the zoo, but we're like around the zoo. And there's like a cute little sea lion bathing in the sun. Right there. How cute. Oh, it's a hands moving. These are the parts of New York that I remember when I was really little, like very vaguely. So they were very entertaining and fun. Um, but we had to keep on walking because we don't have a lot of time. But we just came down here. So like this, I don't know what this is called, but it's in like every movie ever <laughs> about New York City. Did you watch Gossip Girl, Maggie? I watched the first Oh, dang it. This is where Serena and Blair reunite. In that scene where they're crying and everything. Oh, it's so fun. Gosh, this is so cool. Also where one of our favorite Impractical Jokers episodes <laughs> happened. It's just so peaceful out here. It doesn't smell super great, but it's so cool. He's playing guitar over there. I know his fingers are cold in the shade. We came to Strawberry Fields. Big Imagine thing that's all in honor of John Lennon. And there's a man singing here, which I wish he wasn't. <laughs> singing John Denver, John Denver a second ago, so it's kind of odd. I love 
love this area so much. <laughs> I know. I love this walkway. This little bridge is cool. You think this is the rock? Mom and Maggie swear that there's a there's a picture of me from our childhood. Not childhood, from this trip that we took. But we went to like Boston and New York City and all these other places. And I could have sworn that this picture was taken in Boston. And Mom and Maggie swear that it was taken here. But I don't remember it being here. I'll tell you here. why. Because when I came to New York, I wanted to see Strawberry Fields so bad. <laughs> and I had these two little daughters who I thought I had raised to appreciate and love things like that. I didn't even know they what the Beatles threw was. A fit and didn't want to come. So I took a picture because Sarah laid her, threw herself over on a rock in Central Park and talked about how tired she was. And so Lies. then I made them take a photo session. <laughs> That's why I remember. <laughs> I don't think It's so. very enjoyable for me to be back here with my two adult daughters who enjoy this. Holla. <laughs> I did something right. I just don't even think I knew who John Lennon was or what the Beatles were at yeah. the time. So it's like, yeah. well, I didn't know. I didn't get Let me it. get a picture of you two on this rock. I don't think this is the exact one. Do you want me to dramatically throw myself across it? <laughs> if you could, that, that would add to the experience I for me. It was more over here. Yeah. It was nowhere here. It was in Boston outside of the Mayflower. <laughs> I swear it. <laughs> okay, so I have an update, but we're back in Times Square to eat cheesecake on the tickets red steps. Oh god, this is horrifying to walk over. Whew. Okay. How cool. Not a bad view. Hey ladies. Hello. Just gonna eat cheesecake and hang out until we have to pick up our bags to go home. <laughs> oh, it feels good to sit down though. My legs are aching after today. We walked yeah. a lot today. This is too cool. Too cool. We have some uh Fun little random weekend trip. 36 hours, not even a weekend. Yeah, not even a weekend. 36 hours, not even two full days. It's fun. But we had tons of fun, and I think we're all at this point ready to get home because we've been sitting here for a long time. But, but I mean, I could even live in New York. That'd be fun. True. But I'm ready to go home now. So very, very true. But that's it from us. Say goodbye, ladies. Bye. It's goodbye. Been goodbye. Fun. Good trip. We'll put the picture and in of them sleeping in the no, in the lift. No. And I'll send it to Ray then. <laughs> oh, there's the picture. <laughs> Wasn't focusing, sorry. I was awake. <laughs> Mom was awake. Um but yeah, that's it. We'll see you guys on the next little random adventure we decide to go on. Yay, I can't wait. That's all from us. Gatlinburg. Oh, oh yeah. We're all going to Gatlinburg. Everybody. Woo. That's it. Bye. Bye.